What separates a dreamer from a doer? Three words, consistent, follow through. For some reason, everybody don't want to follow through. Everybody talk a good game, but I need you to follow through. You always know a successful person because they got amazing follow through. We got to rise up right now and we got to start and we got to finish. I don't care how good you are. I don't care how talented you are because Bruce Lee said it best. A warrior is an average person with laser-like focus. Don't even worry about your ability. Don't you worry about opportunity. I need you to be a warrior right now and let your work get your opportunity. Let your work get your praise. Let your work open up doors. Let your work get people paying attention. Let your work get the whole world to notice. You got to work. Stop thinking. Stop procrastinating. And you got to work. I need you to rise up to fulfill your dreams. Rise up and attack your goals. There's no time to sleep, no time to nap, no time to waste. If you fall asleep, wake up and rise up again. You should work so hard that you collapse in the bed at night. Sometimes in the afternoon, you're so weary from grinding that your body just collapses. That's okay, have sweet sleep, but when you wake up, grind again. Now is the moment to capture the vision. Here's what success is all about. You need these three things, are you ready? You need skill set, mindset, and opportunity. You need to rise up and understand what success is all about. Skill set, work on your skill. Mindset, work on your mentality, baby, and your opportunity will come. Commit to your dreams, commit to your goals. I need you to rise up and commit to yourself. Commit to the process. I'm tired of you getting on Facebook and social media and Instagram and looking at everybody else. You sit there and look at their house, their cars. You sit there and look at their persons and their bags. And you look and say, man, I wish that was me. I wish that was me. Oh, man, I wish that was me. It can be you, but you got to rise up. You got to commit to the process. You got to get in the game. Stop being a spectator and start being a participant. Trust me, I need you to rise up right now. When your opportunity comes, you better be ready. When your opportunity hits, you better respond, baby. And all the work you put in, all the grind you put in, when your opportunity shows up, you gonna be ready. Hard work will pay off. Now we gotta create the plan. What's your game plan? Okay, I got you excited. I got you fired up. I got you motivated. But what's your game plan? Step one. You need to know what you're going for. You gotta be clear and decisive and have clarity for what you want. Because if you don't have clarity of what you want, you're gonna get distracted. Don't you quit until you get exactly what you want. I'm thinking about the CEO of Walmart right now. The CEO of Walmart right now, Doug McMillan. You guys know he started unloading trucks at the distribution center in the summer, didn't even have a full-time job. He started at Walmart part-time. He finished school, became an assistant manager and a buyer, and now he's a CEO. Hello, he rose up one day. He got started. He stayed committed. And he finished. I need you to think like a shark. Because a shark never stops moving or it dies. I need you to become the CEO of you. And the only way you can do it is you gotta rise up. You gotta stay committed. I know it's gonna be hard. I know it's gonna be ups. I know it's gonna be downs. But let me tell you something. You gonna get there, baby. I know you got a great new idea, congrats. You found an incredible opportunity. Opportunity you needed, I got it. And I know you're going to make it happen. I know you're going to change the world, but you got to have your mindset. You got to have your skill set, and you got to wait for your opportunity. And when your opportunity comes, you got to go forward. You might think to yourself, Walter, man, I've been touched about what's going on in the world, and I want to change and make this world a better place. And how can I help others? Here's how you're going to help others. Rise up. I mean, Nelson Mandela was no different than you, an average man with a laser-like focus. Martin Luther King was no different than you, an average man with a laser-like focus. Oprah, you put in your favorite person. Bill Gates, come on, come on, whoever you really look up to. I want you to understand. 
that they were an average person, just like you. They had an idea. They started. They followed through. And then they finished. Now what you gonna do? What are you actually going to do? Are you gonna say, man, I love all these audios, man, I love all these videos, you get me pumped up and you gonna do nothing? You just gonna sit there and do nothing? I need you to be that average man. I need you to be that average woman, but I need you to understand that you gotta have rise up in you and you gotta have laser-like focus. There's greatness in you. If you rise up, there's so many people counting on you. If you rise up, you've heard this a million times, that the cemetery is full of potential. And that's true. Because that person didn't do what they needed to do through the dash. We all are born and we all gonna die. And I'm gonna ask you a question, what are you gonna do with your dash? Stop searching Facebook and being a spectator on all social media. I came here to motivate you to rise up and make sure that you take advantage of your dash. As long as there's breath in your body, I need you to take advantage of your opportunity when it shows up. Before I promise you one thing, it's gonna be challenged and you're gonna be asking yourself before I promise this, can I really do it? Yeah, you can. What is your vision? I need you to commit to it. Whatever just went through your mind right now, I need it to be big and I need you to commit. I need you to be big thinking. I need you to commit. I need you to make a plan and I need you to follow through. That is all success requires. It's for you to rise up, follow through, and finish. And what you're gonna follow through is no different than the ball player. It's the plan. And let me give you a little secret in basketball. A shooter got perfect form. I need you to have perfect form for your success to happen. I promise you one thing. If you hold yourself accountable, you'll get there. If you hold yourself accountable, it's going to happen. The worst thing you can do is just wait for other people to hold you accountable. Wait for other people to motivate you. Wait for other people to inspire you. How about motivating yourself? How about inspiring yourself? Have you ever thought about motivating somebody else? Have you ever thought about inspiring somebody else? Have you ever thought about lifting somebody else? We need you to be a light in the midst of darkness. This world has gone crazy. This world needs you to rise up. This world needs your dream. This world needs you to achieve everything you got on the inside of you. This world needs you to be you. But in order for you to be you, we got to have you to rise up. Every morning when I wake, I see that sun rise up. And I want you to be just like the sun. I hear a lot about sinners Don't think that I'll be saved But I might go down to the river the way that the sky 